Prime Factorization Today, let us revise Prime Factorization. Before that, let us review Prime and Composite Numbers. A prime number is a natural number that has only two factors, one and the number itself. Look at these examples. The factors of 3 are 1 and 3. The factors of 11 are 1 and 11. The factors of 17 are 1 and 17. Here you can see these numbers have only two factors, one and the number itself. Such numbers are called prime numbers. A composite number is a natural number that has more than two factors. Look at these examples. The factors of 6 are 1, 2, 3 and 6. The factors of 14 are 1, 2, 7 and 14. The factors of 20 are 1, 2, 5, 10 and 20. Here, all the above numbers have more than two factors. These numbers are called composite numbers. Kids, remember 1. 1 is neither a prime nor a composite number. 2. 2 is the only even prime number. 3. 2 consecutive odd primes which differ by 2 are called twin primes. Examples 3, 5 5, 7 11, 13 17, 19 4. Any two numbers that have only one as a common factor are called co-prime numbers. Examples 3, 4, 5, 9, 11, 20. Now let us revise prime factorization. When a number is expressed as a product of prime numbers, it is called prime factorization. Let us solve an example. Express 84 as the product of its prime factors by repeated division. We always begin with the smallest prime number, which divides the given number. 84 is an even number. So, divide 84 by 2 to get 42. Again, divide 42 by 2 to get 21. Now, 21 can be divided by 3. So, divide 21 by 3 to get 7. Lastly, divide 7, which is a prime number, by itself. Now we have 1 as a quotient. Let us write the answer. Thus, the prime factorization of 84 is 2 into 2 into 3 into 7 which can also be written as 
2 squared into 3 into 7. Remember, we always divide by the least prime number which can divide the given number to get prime factors. Today, revising was so much fun.